a first edition of Arms and the Covenant by Winston Churchill. I'm Pom Harrington and I'm the owner of Peter Harrington. Here we have Winston Churchill's book of speeches and as it says on the cover here on foreign affairs national defence. Um, the speeches actually were taken out he was done six years previously to this, to 1930 to 1938, and were actually compiled by his son Randolph. Um, the book is quite interesting because it really is a common theme there where he's talking about the dangers of rearming the Germans and also seeking out peaceful states, nations to form alliances with. Um, he was way ahead of his time, um, and that's why this book is important. Now, the book was issued at 18 shillings, um, which proved to be quite expensive, and although they printed 5,000 copies, only 3,381 copies were sold by 1940, despite the war starting. So they actually repriced it, and it was issued again in 1940 at seven shillings and sixpence. So this is the first issue dust jacket. Um, we can see here, published by George Harrop, and the credits to his son Randolph Churchill. Um, I'll take the jacket off so you can see the book itself. Issued in this blue cloth with gilt on the spine, fairly plain by previous standards, although it has a new, new publisher by this point. A nice copy of an important collection of speeches. For more details on this book and other books by Winston Churchill, please see the Peter Harrington website.